why do we need otisar and what are its various applications let's try to understand this topic in our today's video hello everyone welcome to link frequency and i'm ashwarya patta this video is part of a course that is introduction to otisar so without any further delay let's get started Due to massive innovation in the automotive sector, the dependency on both hardware and the software was on higher side. Hence, any small change in the hardware like the processor, the entire software must be altered in order to make the module functional. This would be time consuming and the effort of development would drastically raise. So, Autosar came into picture to resolve this issue. When Autosar was introduced in 2002, the idea was to bring about standardization in the development of automotive software. Due to standardization the use of software has increased tremendously which enhances the quality of the software by reusing of the software the tendency to create the common errors in the software repeatedly is reduced ultimately increasing the efficiency of the software the amount of time taken to develop the software is also reduced with the standard architecture of autosap the layered architecture of autosap makes the hardware and the software independent of each other the top layer of the autosap is independent of the underlying layers So the software need not know the complete details of the hardware. The same software can be used with different hardware without altering the current working model's functionality. So overall, we can say that Autosar provides the required architecture, which increases the code quality and also guarantees the reuse of software, which is error-free. The modern high-end passenger car has more than 100 million software lines of code written, in which 100 plus ECUs are connected to interact with each other. Autosar creates a huge impact on the everyday life of people. It gives us an opportunity to work on the latest technology and make the systems more efficient. Hence we can find majority of applications of Autosar in vehicles, autonomous cars and advanced safety systems. Autosar is used in the infotainment system which helps in navigation, multimedia support and smartphone pairing and so on. Recently you would have heard about the electrification which is again based on the Autosar standards. Consider any automotive app it supports the basic autosar rules V2X or vehicle to everything which has a motive for road safety and energy saving uses the autosar standards In short autosar is everywhere you look around it has its applications in the senses like lidar and radar it is also used in the adas functions infotainment systems and many more Hence understanding the basic of autosar gives us an opportunity to learn as well as innovate the existing systems in a better way. Thank you so much for watching our video content. I hope you could enjoy the video. For any queries related to this video content, you can surely comment down in the below comment section. Until we meet on our next video, happy learning. Tune yourself to make a difference.